Ladies and gentlemen, my name is CY2 Squared, and you are watching Days Gone. This is the 736th day gone since the shit hit the fan. Today we're doing an, a little side mission called He's My Brother. We're going to head to a Nero checkpoint here on the map, and we're going to find some sterilized bandages for our brother Boozer. He has third degree burns. We ran into some rippers, and they tried to burn his tattoos off. Now, I've already done this, so I'm going to show you the quick and easy route. You don't, obviously don't want to drive right up in front. You want to come off to the side and park at least a little out of the way. This is it, the Nero checkpoint. I gotta find some shit for Boozer's arm. Uh, just out of curiosity, I was looking around and I found this. It's gotta be for some kind of crafting eventually. Scaly Hedgehog. So I thought that was kind of interesting. There's all kinds of weird things you'll be getting in this game. You can hear that there are swarmers around here. Where is he on the roof? Sounds like he might be on the roof. There is an axe back here, and I want to grab it. And that's why I wanted to grab the axe. Okay, so it says find fuel for the generator. Let's go ahead and throw a throw a rock. There's the generator right there. And these guys can smell you and hear you. They can sniff you out. And of course there's cars and this building here. I think there's some kerosene inside this building. But you're going to find the fuel all the way back up in this corner. Now just a good survival tip. Whenever you find fuel, don't just use it for generators. Take it back and fuel up your bike as well. First thing we're going to do is fill the generator. Oh, here we go. But before we turn it on, we're going to check this guy. Scrap inventory. Okay. We're going to go fill up our bike. See him sniffing us out? Isn't that crazy? And that's why I love the axe. Let's go ahead, make sure our bike is all good. Now we can throw down the gas container, pull out the axe. And before we turn the generator on, we're going to climb up on the roof and take out the speakers. This is an electronic building. 
as soon as you turn on the generator there's going to be recordings coming out the speakers and it will attract a entire not a swarm but it attracts a bunch of zombos now we can t hit the generator come on you son of a bitch you better start You can hide in trash cans, as you saw saw there. Sterile Dumpsters. Sterile bandages. Sterile bandages. Where the hell would they keep this shit? You're gonna find your. Well, first off, your sterile bandages are right there, along with something else that we require. Our unit is getting ready to pull out. Got word a few minutes ago. All the work we've been doing out here is a waste of time. Hundreds of infected people are swarming up the highway out of farewell. If you were reading that with your friends, welcome to my world, you stupid son of a bitch. If you were reading the subtitle, from this guy we get plus one IPCA tech. I'm assuming that's something for upgrades. Um if you were reading the subtitles, it said Colonel and Lieutenant, like the military was shooting people, and a, uh, some kind of medical assistant or doctor was saying, no, they didn't do anything. This is crazy, just madness. Yes, sterile bandages. Just what the doctor ordered. Now I just gotta get this back to Boozer. How? Oh, hello. So, at neuro checkpoints, you're gonna find these things called neuro injectors. And what they will do is What's this? Nero tank. Uh, some sort of a injector of some kind. Uh, why the hell not? <laughs> why the hell not? You can pick from they're going what they do is they permanently increase health, stamina, or focus. For right now, I'm gonna get my stamina up. Ooh. And it and it does help. That'll do it. Okay, so now we are permanently upgraded plus 25. And we can get the hell out of here. Oh, I didn't think he'd be able to get me. She'd be able to get me. Goodbye. Boozer, you there? Boozer, goddammit, answer me. He's not picking up. Where the hell is he? Jesus, this isn't a goddamn bike. I just bought a motorcycle uh, about a week ago. Uh, pretty nice hey, bike, John, 800 custom. When you get to the tower, my radio uplink has been shut down. I'll pay you to restore it. So these men, you know them, because shutting down radio free organ seems kind of personal. God damn right, it's personal. They used to be a part of my camp. They didn't like the fucking stealing, raping, murdering. Now maybe they're like me, just tired of listening to your paranoid truth or bullshit. St. John out. One more thing. When they left, it appears they may have stolen some automatic rifles and a few shotguns. Watch yourself. Jesus, Cole, thanks for the heads up. So that's going to be our next mission, taking out the radio tower. And even though they have automatic weapons, shotguns, that's telling me that maybe I can pick up some automatic weapons and shotguns for myself. Let's go ahead up here and take care of Boozer and make sure he's alright. We need to keep him alive. It's part of our mission to keep him alive. Hey, Boozer, I, uh, found some shit for your arm. Boozer? Oh, shit. Boozer! Hey! Whoa, ah! Hurry! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, shit! Oh, shit, Deke. Oh. Could've blown your goddamn head off. Look, uh, let me, let me see that arm, huh? No, no, I got Come this. Come on, let me see that arm. I got Come on. it! All right! Just 
D. Thanks, brother. Look, I'll, I'll be better, okay? I'm gonna be fine. All right. And with that mission complete, bugged the hell out, uh, plus 3,000 XP, and we could have got all the way up to 6,550. I'm sure if I would have done more exploring, more fighting, less stealth, we would have got some more experience points, plus 750 trust with Copeland's camp. Here's my brother, 12%. Now, here's, or, I'm sorry, he's my brother. That's sort of like a main mission, and the mission is to keep him alive. So you're going to have several side missions that you have to do to complete the main mission. He's my brother. The one that we just, the, the, uh, think of it as like a branching uh, main mission. Uh, we just completed, bugged the hell out. And I do believe that in the next episode we will locate the Cascade Radio Tower ambush camp and uh, see if we can't get an assault rifle. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I'm doing a full walkthrough of Days Gone. This has been the 736th Day Gone.